Same thing. He said that dude helped mm -hmm. him, man. He told some in depth stories, stories. about country. Yeah, Wayne. because another thing, that was another thing. Jordan is committed to comedy. Mm -hmm. Very much so. And he one of the people that's like, I'm going to figure this out. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. And for me, but I, I, I empathize now. I do too because we've had we've had some uh, guests on here lately, mm -hmm. and I was like, man, I got to do this interview because I want people to know I'm not I'm I'm not definitely biased. I'm not biased, but I understand evolution too. Like evolution. what you just said, you just said that you're not this or that, but in my heart, whatever you are, you're not what you're about to be as you move forward. Right. You're growing every day. I grow, man. So when we start putting each other in boxes and saying, oh man, he not this because I ain't rocking with him, that's you being immature. Immature. Because every day, people are evolving. People are changing. Yep. The person I was a year ago, two years ago, I'm not that person anymore. Every day is a new day for us to be better on this earth. I love everybody, man. I, yeah. For the first time in my life, I could say that. Whereas, this is, how, this is how I look at it. I look at it like this. I can disagree. It's okay to disagree. True. It's okay to not like what I do. It's okay. But if I see you... I don't care if you got a boyfriend. I don't care if you got ugly feet. I don't care if you was a little person. What are we calling people nowadays? If I see you fall into that water and you about to drown, gonna try to gonna try to I'm going to try to get you up out of there. Yeah. So that's where I'm at now in my life. So I'm okay with saying, oh, I disagree with that. I'm okay with somebody saying, well, I believe, you know, I believe in, I'm, I believe in Allah. I don't believe what you believe in, Mike. Okay, cool. But let's just make sure we won't let each other drown. Hey, yeah, that's how I look at it. I agree, man. I I really be honest with you. When you said you was coming on the show, man, and the phase on love and all the stuff that Ben said, I think that's the only thing that Country Wayne brought up in the where it might have been a little bit, you know, like it went a different way than I thought it would. Mm -hmm. But I was thinking about Country Wayne. I was like, man, I got to get that dude on the show. I told you that that night. Mm -hmm. You called you 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 hit us up. Like right during that time, I said, "Ain't nothing but God." I'm yeah. being real. I was like, "Man, I I was trying to figure out how to link with these people." I asked Jordan Jackson. Mm -hmm. We talked about Country Wayne on Jordan Jackson. That's another time where mm -hmm. he he really loved uh, Country, Country Wayne, Wayne, man. Help helping with the success, but then Country Wayne came and took it to a whole another level mm -hmm. because he's dropped knowledge on me, million dollar knowledge. Because you know he's the only millionaire that I know, like truly know. You know that people got bread, but that I seen go from. 10,000 to a million plus right in front of my eyes. So the knowledge, and he's never, as soon as he finds out something, he's like, Jordan, I just found this out, man. You need to implement this. You need to, like, he's always trying to bring there him. to make sure that he wants his team to, 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 to eat and be self sufficient. A lot of times people, they had a bag. And they, they try to give you enough to where you're dependent on them. He doesn't operate like that. He don't want you to be dependent on him. He wants you to be self-sufficient. If you need him, I'm, I'm here for you. But he wants you to be able to, to, to have your own, which is, which is super, super great because that's what we need to teach men and um, uh, 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 our brotherhood anyway. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Teach them the formula so that they can start their own kingdom as well. Same thing he said that dude helped mm -hmm. him, man. He told some in-depth stories, stories about country. Yeah, Wayne. because another thing, that was another thing. Jordan is committed to comedy. Mm -hmm. Very much so. And he one of the people that's like, I'm going to figure this out. You know, you look at him like, oh, he's ha ha, but he's very competitive. Yes. But when he first started doing the comedy thing in Atlanta, people were taken to him. And Wayne was like, you funny. <laughs> this man got booed off the stage. Mm. He said, man, bro, when Wayne... He said, when I got booed up the stage and I bombed, well, I don't think he got booed, I don't think he got booed up, he got bombed, he, he bombed. He said, man, when I bombed, bro, I had I walked backwards to get my check from Wayne, I knew I was gonna see him again. <laughs> and he said, um, he said, I got my check from him and I just kinda, my mind was like, yeah, usually that's the end. And Wayne was like, all right, man, well, I'll see you next week. He was like, I ain't fired? He said, man, you funny, man. You gotta just, we gonna just figure it out. That's dope, man. That's, That's this who guy he is. special, man. He's special. He's very special to keep on the tenacity. Yeah. You know, to keep going no if matter what. If he believes in something. He ain't trying to hear it. He don't care. When, like, it's been situations where with me and him, I'm like, bruh, I don't think this person's, I don't know about that. He's like, no, nah, no. Nah, they good. He believes. We're going to figure it out. And he wow. right. He be right. You know, I be, be right. I come out, yeah, you was right, man. She just needed a little <laughs> this or that. But nigga, I'd have fired her ass. <laughs> 
we on Boss Talk 101.